JCS Industries presents How It Works. Hello, I'm Brian Whitmore, and today we're going to talk about the JCS Model 4150 Automatic Vacuum Emulsion Polymer Feeder. It dilutes, activates, and feeds most emulsion polymers for water and waste treatment. First, the major components. The freestanding mounting panel, which contains all the components that make up the feed system. The master controller, where the feed rates, control scenarios, and electrical connections are made. The chemical flow sensor. This monitors the chemical feed rate and reports the actual flow to the master controller. The chemical metering block houses the metering device that controls the chemical feed rate. The polymer reductor. This creates the vacuum to pull the chemical through the system and into the solution stream. The post deductor mixing module. An inline static mixer that enhances the polymer activation. Here, neat polymer is pulled via vacuum from the inductor. As an example, the controller is set to 1.5 gallons per hour. The sensor measures that number against the actual neat polymer flow rate. It sends a signal to the controller to adjust the valve as necessary to maintain the correct feed rate automatically. In utilizing the self-regulating and control concept, the feeder can react to impurities or clumps of solidified polymer that normally shut down conventional pump type feed systems. This self-regulating feature is ideal for partial or total feed disruptions, whereas conventional or pump type feed systems can be shut down by impurities such as clumped or solidified polymer. The 4150 can detect these disruptions and adjust the valve as necessary. Other unique functions of the 4150 include loss of feed detection and multiple control modes, which include local fixed feed and remote set point control, with feed rates of neat polymer from 0.25 to 10 gallons per hour. And that's how it works. For more information on the Model 4150 or any of the other JCS products, please visit our website at jcsindustries.us.com. Thank you.